clear so here it means mustahab do not remove your socks if you are a musafir and what are the timings of the musafir and what are the conditions is waqtun muhaddada the particular timings for the musafir it is 3 days and 3 nights if he is a musafir and this hadith does not talk about uh, it's it's only talk about musafir the next hadith talks about the muqim 3 days and 3 nights for example how how when the the time starts for for the masah for example uh, morning today morning you wore socks at 6 o'clock okay so the time starts or with the with the breaking of the wudu or with the masah this is one of the opinions of the scholars but majority of the scholars they say for example you wore socks at 6 o'clock you broke wudu at 7 o'clock and you you made wudu at 8 o'clock when you made wudu at 8 o'clock and you made masah that's when the time starts so from that 8 o'clock till 3 days and 3 nights you are valid you are allowed to make masah how many number of times n number of times how many number of times you want to make am i clear am i clear it is not the timings when you may wear, may wear socks it is when you make wipe the socks wipe the socks wipe your feet that's when the timing starts for example 6 o'clock you made, you made wudu and you wore the socks you broke the wudu at 10 o'clock you made masa at 12 o'clock so when the time starts 12 o'clock am i clear about this matter so 12 o'clock to next 3 days and 3 nights that's that's where you are valid to make masa on the socks am i clear tayyib inshallah we'll go on to the hadith number one of the reasons why one of the reasons why um, uh, we make masa on the socks is that there is something called qaida in the in the faqiya that is al mashaqqatu tajlibu taysir al mashaqqatu tajlibu taysir how do you translate this al mashaqqatu tajlibu taysir the difficulty leads to something easiness isn't it it is very difficult for example if you are traveling to remove socks every time to wear socks every time to remove for example if you are uh, traveling and there is a basin you go to the washroom there are non muslims standing there are muslims standing there they all washing suddenly what you do is you remove the socks and you put the feet there remove the socks and you put the feet there how does it look it's fine in the sight of allah subhanahu wa taala but how does it look for them it's like what is he doing i am washing my hands he put his feet there so allah subhanahu wa taala has made concession here for us this to avoid the mashaqqa for example if you are traveling in the train for example and we know our trains are very clean isn't it so if you have to remove the socks wear it it's going to dirty more so just make masa on it so this are all something rugas a concession from allah subhanahu wa taala easy for us that is why we say al mashaqqa tu tajlibu taysir and this is from the mercy of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uh, allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the quran wa ma ja'ala alaykum fi ad-din haraj and we have not made this religion as a, a difficult for you yuridu allah bikum al yuridu allah bikum an yusra wa la yuridu bikum al usr allah does not want difficult for you allah wants easy for you when allah wants easy for us who are you to make difficult subhanallah this is what we i have to understand that islam the religion of islam is easy not difficult 